In this tutorial today, I'm going to show you how to achieve those melanin skin tone looks in your portraits in Photoshop. And we are going to be using only our blending options and the black and white layer. And we are going to play around with that to get the melanin skin tone look in Photoshop. And guys, if you're watching this video for the first time, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And before I can go ahead, this image was taken by a photographer. He's called Dream Splash Photography. I'm going to put his link down the description down in the description of this video so that you guys can follow him on his Instagram and yeah this was a part of his retouching challenge and he took this beautiful image and the model is amazing and as you can see I already did some adjustments to this particular image so I can show you what I did so this was the initial image after my camera ad adjustments and then I did my frequency separation for this particular image so this was uh, before after before after it is really subtle enough and I used my mixer brush tool in Photoshop then after I did some little dodging and burning and see before after before after I was just enhancing these highlights and I have a video about this my global dodging and burning then after after this uh, I duplicated my dodging and burn layer because I wanted to uh, enhance it a little bit more and make it pop. So what I did, uh, I created a stamp visible layer by press, pressing shift Control e on the keyboard to create this layer. And the reason for this is I wanted to play around with, uh, to get uh, all my editing in one layer. So that is the reason for the stamp visible layer. Then I duplicated it. So this was the image after doing the melanin uh, skin tone color grading. So I want to show you guys how I achieved this. So I'm running from this photography. Sorry, I hadn't introduced my, myself. And I'm sorry, I, my tongue keeps on slipping because I want this video to be really, really short enough and that's the reason for my slip of the tongue so i'm going to delete this uh, color grading layer and i'll show you guys how i did this just come right here to uh, your adjustment layers so click on it then click on black and white so the image will totally turn into a uh, black and white so just come to the blending options and uh, first of all you're going to click on overlay so you can see the image already looks uh melanated so if at all you feel this is too much for your liking just come and reduce on the opacity yeah you can get those beautiful melanin tones so um, for the sake of this tutorial i'm going to leave it at 100 percent so that you guys can see the effect it brings to the image so i'm going to come back and I create a black and white layer then this time I'm going to use multiply as my blending option as you can see this is too much so I'm just going to come and reduce on the opacity for my for my second layer so as you can see we already have that melanated look so I'm going to put these two in a group shift and I click on the lower one ctrl G to put this in a group so I'm going to name this a melanin so i want to show you guys the before and after for this image so before after before after you can see uh this video uh the, the image really looks uh melanated and uh the skin tones are really dark and popping and they bring out that black feel the beautiful melanin black feel so if at all you feel this is too much for your liking just come to the group and reduce on its opacity uh, to your liking. So this is the before and the after. So this tutorial has been about how to create those melanin skin tones in Photoshop. And you have been using uh, the black and white adjustment layers and uh, the blending options as overlay and multiply. So if you are at all you love this video, don't forget to leave a comment down in the comment section. And don't forget to like this video. And subscribe this channel if at all you're watching this tutorial. I'm Ronix from Ronix Photography. Thank you for watching. Till next time.